Welcome back to another how-to guide by Trend Micro. My name is Michael Clifford. I'm a support engineer for Trend Micro, working with products such as Apex One, Apex Central, Office Scan, and a slew of other products. So today we're just going to talk about how to prep your Apex One to receive policy from Apex Central, so you can start managing all of your your exclusions and deployments and such through Apex Central policy rather than trying to do it through the uh, means of Apex One. So the most important part uh, initially is to move the product uh, after it's registered out of the new entity folder so it may receive policy. So we're just gonna briefly go through that today. So once you're logged into the Apex Central and you're in an admin account that has uh, sufficient rights to move things around and create directories, you just go to directories and products. And this is the listing of folders and the different products you have. And as you see, it's in new entity and it defaults there. Uh, when it's in here, you cannot deploy policy. You will receive logs, but you can click on the server itself and get some vital details such as patterns and lists and all that good stuff. So in order to get it prepped to receive policy, we'll just go ahead and click on directory management. Select the folder you want it to go under. In this case, we're gonna go under local folder and click add folder. And we just designate the, the name of the folder. So in this case, this is gonna be our Apex One instance. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put Apex One so we know that all of our Apex One servers will go in there. In order to retain permissions of users when they're moving around, just go ahead and check this box. And once the folder is created, it's a simple matter of clicking on it and then dragging it over to the Apex One folder and dropping it in. You'll get a prompt saying if it's okay, and uh, it's different per browser, but this is what Chrome looks like. Simply click okay, and we're good to go. So everything is set for that Apex One server to start getting policies, um, and that will be a separate video on policy management. Until next time, have a good day. Bye.